Welcome to a new video from Logic Bus. Based on a previous video introducing the controlling of VLC, now we are going to show your design VLC how this works creating the analog input and activating three relay outputs. For demonstration purposes, the analog input, we will connect the low cell to sense the weight. On the relay output, we will have three indicators LEDs. But in this output, we can connect the maximum of 30 BDC to 6 amperes or 250 BAC to 6 amperes. Now, I will briefly explain all the controlling connections. With a low cell of 1000 pounds on the cell amplifier with the voltage output, both from field experiment, we will connect it to the 24 volt source of the controlling of VLC and from we will tilt the amplifier. The low cell will be connected to its amplifier and the analog output will be connected from the amplifier and we will connect into the controlling input. For the grounded actuators, the outputs will be R0, R1 and R2. On top of the screen it shows the libraries we need to program it. Then we will declare the variables on each of its inputs and outputs, which we have the controlling rate 0, has a main input with three outputs which are R0, R1 and R2. Next, we will declare the speed of capacity measurement to read of data from analog input. We create an integer name sensor value equal an analog read which will be a controlling A0. Now to convert this number to pounds we have to add an integer weight equal to sensor value times 0.03 which is a factor that low cell give us times 100. Our loop will start if weight is less than we will write or print 1 in our output to indicator. If weight is less than the indicator and it is will turn off the another two LEDs to not indicate those outputs. And it will print into the screen weight is less than indicator. Next, we will do the next cycle inside the main loop, which if the weight is less than or equal 10 and less than 20 if it will be an ideal weight, which it will turn on the green LED R1 and this will maintain the R0 and R2 off. It will print ideal weight on the screen. Next, we will do the next cycle inside the main loop, which if is the weight more than the equal of 20, it will be an weight is more the indicator, which is will turn on the green LED R2 and this will maintain the R0 and R1 up, plus it will print more than the ideal weight to the screen. Finally, it will print the variable weight on the screen within one second delay. Now, we can observe that it's capturing data in this working turning on the LEDs which indicator weight is less than indicator. Also, it shows the message of the screen and the number of the pounds waiting. We press a little more and low cell on top. We got the ideal weight. With this, we grant LED will turn on and a message of ideal weight will show on the screen. In this case, it was programmed from 10 to 20 pounds ideal weight, but it can be programmed to any value. We keep pressing stronger until we turn on the third LED which will bring the message or a screen of will is more than the indicator and the number that is weight in. Thanks for watching another Logic Bath video. For the more information for this or a different equipment, you can communicate into these phone numbers and emails. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us in our social media. On the description shows the links and the pages to our virtual stores.